once you want to step, make that step up in performance on a cruising catamaran, you go from something like a Katana or an Outremer, where do you go? Something you want to race as well. In the UK, I would probably say Dazcat. In France, it's mastered and composites. And they first built the TS42, and they've now come with this brand new TS5. This is model number three. And you can probably just see from the, the shape and the beam, the power alone that this has the potential for. They've done very well already at Le Voile de Saint Barts. TS42s have won two years in a row. Um, and these boats are all about the structure and the stiffness. They're minimalist inside, we'll have a look, but they're lightweight and they really move. So Marsden and Composites, they're based in Lorraine in the old submarine pens there, and they're well versed at building lightweight structures and race boats. They built the old E-Deck for Francis Jean, for example. The 42 and this TS5, super fun looking, high performance cruising cats that can be raced and uh, this one comes out, a standard boat comes out at 8.6 tonnes. This particular one has been built uh, for a guy to live aboard cruise on, um, but just sail at high speed. So I was watching a video yesterday of it sailing at 25 knots off Cannes in 25 to 35 knots wind, and it looked like a hell of a lot of fun. You can see it's going to reward someone that enjoys being at the helm. Bucket seats, tiller steering, big dagger boards. Yeah, it's all about having some some fun at high speed. You can tell probably straight away, minimalist, open, bright light, no cockpit table for example. All the furniture, foam cord, vinalesta, painted mouldings, keep everything simple and light. This one, I think I said earlier, is 8.6 8 tonnes, but number four it has 70% carbon, so that takes the, with the weight down by another tonne. But it's an inviting looking interior, I really like it. So the owner of this one uh, is living aboard, uh, so he's chosen to put on quite a few more appliances, added a bit more weight. It's got a TV, it's got, I think, a washing machine and things on here as well. Great pilot berth up here. Owner's hull, all on the starboard side. And, and in this port float, you've got three different types of berths, two cabins and a, another sort of pilot berth underneath us here. 